Okay, so... I feel like last time I got a little distracted by these question marks, but... I didn't realize people pointed out that as you're doing these challenges, there's like modifiers in the top right, apparently. I, I was too flustered by the combat to notice, so I'll try and keep an eye out for that this time. There is a cursed chest there, but I feel like this point of interest, I might just not be strong enough for that. We're right here, so we can check this one at least. Um, before we head out and make the story choice. I got my glasses, as you can see. These are, these, these are my new frames. It's hard to describe when you're used to straining your eyes for so long. I can feel my eyes wanting to adjust, but then being like, oh, I can see it really easily. <laughs> I don't believe it. Hey, thick skin. You're back. Why? Good day to you Why too, not? thick skin. <laughs> How do things stand since last I saw you? Would it please you to hear all is well and you are the author of it? Well, all is not well. And yes, you are the author of it. Kate is gone. Hmm. Where? Why? We had an argument. Harsh words were spoken. She left for the woods. Can't really blame I her. I would have you bring her back. I don't have time to go chasing after her. What makes you think I do? You will do me this favor. After all, the situation is at least in part your fault. <laughs> My fault, really. My fault? If your bond with your sister is broken, I suggest you look closer to home. Mm-hmm. All was well with That's us a before good you answer. came, Banisher, and now it is not. Folk worry. I must settle them with Kate's return. They still don't know what you did, do they? She's probably gone to the hunting lodge she likes to spend time in, near hmm. the road to Boston. Find her, bring her to her senses, then send her back here. Send her home. What if she doesn't want to? What's the word around camp? The word on what? How goes the situation here? After you travelled on, things here soured. Kate was much troubled, like I've never seen her. Days passed in silence. When at last she spoke, her fury shocked us all. And then she left. Just upped and walked out. Hmm. I wish to be of service. Who in the camp needs helping? I don't bloody know, do I? I'm still clearing up Kate's mess. Everyone needs help, I shouldn't wonder. I wonder if you banished one of the sisters, what the outcome right. would be here. I'll be leaving. Because obviously if you banish Thickskin, then this whole conversation isn't here. Would Kate still leave? Would then someone else be like, I wonder where Kate is? Will Kate even listen to me? Let's talk to her and find out. Dude, I can see so clearly. This is so weird. Where did Kate go? The road to Boston? The Wolf Within? Oh yeah, the Werewolf book. Is that a point of interest? Yeah. There's tons of stuff here. Oh, this area. Right, right, right. Talk to Kate at her cabin. Oh, she's not. She's just at home. If she's only 200 meters away, right? Might as well. Ah, the road to Boston. I love how Kate is like, or Thick Skin is like, I'm too busy. It's like, dude, it's 200 meters away. I hope she's okay, though. I wonder if she'll tell us something about what happened with her lover. Kate, where is she? Is she not here? Good day to you, sir. I'm Red McCraith. I'm the Banisher. You ass. <laughs> um. No dust. Oh, whoever was here took all the guns. You'll have to make do with what you've got. Is this the... Is this from Kate? Catherine? Did we read this? 
I will not ever be able to make you open your eyes to what you did. I set these deaths on you where they belong. This is your burden, not mine. To watch you pretend that nothing happened, that life goes on unbothered, suff suffocates me. Better I leave, better for you, for me, for all those who still trust you. Poor souls, if only they knew. Goodbye, Rose. Is that her real name? Thick skin? You are in charge for good. I shall away to Boston. Worry not for me as I walk along the cliff and away. Worry instead for the state of your own soul. Oh yeah, Kate's letter. Here's a... It's more serious than thick skin knew. Maybe there's still time. If we make for the bridge to Boston. Is there still anything... I guess our hand isn't glowing green, so maybe not. Okay, so where is she going? Here? We haven't been there. Could do. I hope she's okay. I liked her more than thick skin. Well, thick skin is cool because she's like thick skinned. <laughs> but I felt bad for Kate being like the younger sibling and all. Can we lower this? Creep and Ivy again. As invasive uh, as regular weeds. Can't do anything with that. Hmm. So I might not be able to reach her yet, actually. Because I don't have the power for the IV yet. Well, at least now it's added to the map, so we can remember that. Oh, and that one there. It's hidden behind the obstacle. Okay, so then we go east, I would say. Let's make a story choice. So either we go the Swamp Witch. Oh, that's just the Fort Jericho or the Harrows. The Harrow sounds cooler, honestly. So I have to travel there when I can. Um, I'll have to walk back to the village. And open the door for someone. My socks arrived. <laughs> I realized I didn't have any black socks. Isn't that weird? I always buy colors, but then recently I was like, I should just wear black socks with this outfit. And then I was like, I don't have any anymore. I have baby blue, purple, pink. So I was like, I'll buy some black socks. Very essential conversations to have during this playthrough of Banishers. Socks are very important. You want to match the right socks with the right outfit? Let's travel south. It follows both of them automatically, but I want to go this way. So to my left. Here we go! That, that way is New Eden Town. Oh yeah, the bridge is out. I forgot. Nightmare can take so many forms. The snow, broken bridges, all of it. Snow. I know. You always wonder, was this caused by nature or by the ghost? Green hellebore. I can hear it. Oh! Yeah, I don't think I can hit it through the planks. That works. I'm really happy it's unlimited ammo. I won't have to worry about that. We won't be going this way. This country needs better bridges, <laughs> or it will come to nothing. <laughs> Which is funny, because it's still true to this day. At least I saw a thing a couple of years ago about how bad America's infrastructure actually is. Like, they'll... Their bridges are not really in good state anymore, because they're, they're not getting enough funding to keep them in good upkeep. Okay, let's check the question mark on the right down here. These will be the harrows. An imaginative name. There's a ring to that. Mm, that's why I'm here. 
Sounds cooler than a fork. Ooh. Uh, how do we do this again? Right click? Yeah. Wasn't I always? Oh, there's little dudes here! Little dude! Uh, how do I fight again? I forget how to dodge. Um, let's not control. Oh, yeah, controls to not C. Right is to do a heavy strike. Okay. How do I dodge? Oh, uh, space. Oh, it's one of these. Mm, okay. Let me just get some things. I thought this was another one. I was like, two? No, thank you. Oh, little wispies. There we go. Okay, so is this one of those that has a like this bit challenge or modifier? Let me try it. Uh, what is this? Unveil yourself. Hugging all the fun. Enemies burst upon death. I see it. <laughs> I can see it, guys. Oh, and it hurts them and me. Uh. Oh, you can see the explosion radius on the ground. Go, go, go. I'll go. Oh, oh. And then the green one helps the other guys, right? So I should focus on this guy. There. And then kill this guy. Then back up. Nice. Oh. Damn, they hurt. Think you could take on a ghost? Come on, punch him, punch him. Yeah. Get him, get him. Oh wait, didn't I have the modifier that the next shot was like really powerful? Yeah. One less to worry about. Ouch. Ugh. Oh. Oh, that was hard. Ah, ah, stop hitting me! There's more of them. Oh. <sighs> I keep trying to roll out of the way, but I can't make it. Ooh, big one. Oh, I should reload, yeah. Smart me. Almost have a full bar. There, full bar. So now I shoot. Oh, take that! Ah! Okay. Let me just move back a little bit. Oh yeah, wait. Wasn't it? Oh, he dodged. Ah, oh, he dodged. I wanted to do a headshot, but um, how do I? Lock again? Was it C? And then... Uh, nope. Messed up. Messed up. Just trying to do the counter thing. Didn't work, but... Nice! I can help. Oh. Okay. Pick up all the things. Is that it? I think so. I did it! And I saw the modifier. That's more what I did. <laughs> I think I continue on here. Or I can. Let's see. Oh, I thought it was this... Oh no, the bridge was out! Yeah, 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 yeah. That was that bridge. Mm. 
He's gonna dodge. No, he didn't. Oh, you're not dodging. <laughs> nice. That wasn't too bad. Couple of headshots. Do 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 do. Now, who will we meet at the Harrows? Some green hellebore noise. Quest started. Witch finders. Over there. What? A dock. Ooh. An underground landing. Interesting. Why can't I hit that? Too far. It's because of my new glasses. I can see everything. <laughs> Shall we? Do I have to fight here? I wonder what was landed here all that time ago. Something illicit, no doubt. What does illicit mean again? Illegal? Oh. Oh, hi, guys. Watch out. Spectre position. Moving, moving. Nice. Did we miss a few? Nice. Oh, oh. I got the good shot. That's still so fun! Blast them to kingdom come, literally. Amazing. It's my favorite power yet in this game. So do I take the elevator up? But what about down here? The dock. Something- ooh! Doing that. Got any goodies? You sure do. Okay. I hear a little white ball as well. Where is it? Oh, is it Take that. Ooh, what is this? What do we got here? Healing shop. Open details. Antea's strength is what I'm currently taking. Damage taken reduced by 5%. Hitting a weak spot with the rifle restores health! Heck yeah. There it is. Okay. Is that all this here? No, this one. Company of 100 Associates. Who's that? I, I believe it was a new French trading company before you and I were born. The cave oh. has been abandoned for a while then. Ah, uh, there's probably a French smuggler's den. Cool. it for down here most of it oh I can climb up this little building haven't done that yet wool nice I thought I saw something like in the corner of my eye, I saw something that was really bright, and I was like, "What was that?" So I thought it was an item shimmering. Okay, I think 
that's most of it here. I could never. I would never make it. Having done like pull up practice and stuff and how hard that actually is, <laughs> I would never be able to climb up a rope like that. How do I heal again? Was it? Oh, F, I think. F to feel. Ooh, only 40 meters. 37. And, ooh, this is new. What are you? Waxy cap agaric. I don't think we've had that mushroom before. Ceridian's island is a pleasant place, but you'd never know it from here. Better to keep it that way, eh? For everyone's sake. Is it that down there? Or further back? I don't really know. The Harrows! We're here! There's no one here! <laughs> Hello! Yoohoo! Harrows? Anyone? There's something here. I, I was just thinking it's too quiet. <gasps> Wolf! They never I got know, you. Do they? Kill it, quick! Punch him! Yeah! Move Woo! It. Don't explode! Um, you know what? This is a good one for... Her. Nice. That was awesome. I almost had my bar full. Move yourself. Ooh. Yeah, punch the shit out of him. Get it. Think Get it. Take on Against the wall. <laughs> Ooh, what was that? Whoa. What is that? Oh. <laughs> I feel like a bloody target practice. <laughs> I was like, wait, I have my super shot. <laughs> Perfect. Right in time for the big guy to show up. Damn. What a great power. And it heals me, right? Ghastly concretion. The nightmare Lindsay. has influence here. We should be careful. Okay. No matter the bridge, we can cross it. Keep your feepers peeled, Red. Oh. It's a wolf in the tree. With linen. Let's see what's next. Oh, that looks important. Oh. Wait, did I get turned around? Yeah, I'm looking in the wrong... Maybe we should... Well, I can check the point of interest for sure. But then we should maybe turn around before checking more of this area. Let's try it. Spectre nearby. Oh! Big one. Beast. Oh, someone I know. Okay, let's try it. Unveil yourself. So this one has a modifier too, right? That's not the ritual I'd have used. Oh. He said Spectre, right? Oh, and now I can't do it. He said there was a Spectre around, right? There might be some mushroom around here. Since we need it. Or not. 
The landscape here is more pleasant. There are fields and pastures and better weather. Can you feel the warmer air? I don't feel it, not really. But I know it's there. If I focus, I can still see the beauty of the world. Hmm. I'd be tempted to think the warmer air means a warmer welcome. I suspect I'll be wrong. Trust yeah. that instinct, young apprentice, for it will serve you well. Six. Nice. And a campfire nearby. That's good. I think I heard the sound of a gun cocking. Ah! Sorry, I wouldn't have more time. Oh, it's a green guy. Ah! Gotta go get it. That was him. Yeah, take that. Ah, the block too. Ah, oh, I try, but. Nice. I think I broke some of his armor or something. Okay. Um. Ooh. Got that from him? Hmm. Wonder if the campfire is here in the cave. Whoa. Suddenly I can't manifest. Ghost That's not good. Something magic hinders me. You're unable to use switch Sente and use her abilities in here. Find the ghost ward and destroy it. So maybe... Oh yeah, it is the campfire here. Hmm. Oh, here it is. I'm still hindered. There oh, must be more? another ward nearby. Okay, let me see. I can't, Rory. The other one then. Oh, wait, this is not the exit. Where did I come in? Uh -huh. I'm getting turned around. Oh, is that it? Better. Thank you. Ah. These wards look fairly new. A witch? Doesn't look like Seeker or Ceridian's work. Let's be careful. Hmm. Okay. Determined to drink more water again. That's why I'm doing my best. Because I've been really bad about drinking my water lately. Man, I have nothing to upgrade. Dang it. Three hundred destructibles. That's cool. I'm struggling to see where I came from. How did I get in? Yeah, oh wait. I did come through there. I guess it lo soft locked me in the that position to help me with the different types of wards. It's funny I'm getting trying to get used to these new glasses. I'm like my eyes are way more relaxed than normally but i am getting a bit nauseous because i think i'm not used to like the cylinders the stigmatism correction so that's funny normally this game doesn't make me nauseous at all so that's i'll definitely have to get used to that it definitely helped with um reading as well tested the glasses out earlier today. I started reading um, a 1958 novel about a woman who has someone stay at her place. Like, it's a family and they're short on money, so they are renting out the attic room. 
It's something like the hours before dawn or something is what it's called. So far, it's always like a little risky. Like reading an older book like that, you never know if it's going to be written or easy to read, if that makes sense. Like the English can be a bit stiff when it's an older book, but I had such a good time uh, reading Psycho, which was from 56 or something. That's oh, locked. Doors blocked on the other side. But I was like, you know what? This one's supposed to be good. I had like a new, newly re released edition. Current, uh, like a very recent one that was in stores. I was like, I'll try it out. Hmm, can I peek inside? Ah, uh, there's a barricade I can shoot, but how do I... Through the roof, maybe? I'll deal with it quickly. Who is this? Okay. Haha, <laughs> little did she know. I had a super shot ready. Reinforcements. Nice. Not too bad, not too bad. Good job, Red. I should save my super shot actually for no one. I was worried that maybe a second one would show up. It is through the roof. Look at my gamer senses tingling. Crisp moss. It's so pretty. Pretty flowers. What is it? What do I get? What's my reward? Ghastly concretion and witch stone. Is this back? No, this is its own little area. I'll have a peep. Let's see if I can find those ghost wards. Probably in the house. Wards. You're on your own. Oh, that's a Antea. Black it. Hmm. I don't see any ghost wards from here. I feel a draft from the invisible. Oh, before you go down in that case. Uh aha. -huh. Now who is this? Someone with silver. See if I can find them. Yep. Hey. No more wards. Thank you. Will and I argued. The frost has not yet lifted and we will be late in planting. This winter has not been easy and if there is no harvest next winter shall be worse. How the time passes, but not the frost. We may not yet plant it. We have not yet planted and now I'm feeling unwell. I shall take to my bed and write again when I'm up. So was the frost lingering too long, or There's a was lock. were they stuck in time? Key. Official translation of the Bible. Okay, we need a key. Let's see. Shall we? Can we get up there? I 
doesn't look like it. But then where would be... Oh! The key. Oh. Hmm, can I move this? What if I put it on this other side? Aha! Uh -huh. I didn't see this at all. The key must be here. Nope. Not yet. No! Oh, I see. I wanted him to jump across, but I'm supposed to do this. Anything here? He has to be close by, right? Oh, hello. Faith is dead, and now these creatures are roaming around our farm. I barely escaped and found refuge here on the heights, but I don't know how long I can hold out. No one will come for me. Oh, Lord of mercy. Poor dude. Even though he could have gone in the caves. There's the key. Should I go back? Oh, this loops back. Back in the house we go. Uh, oh yeah. There it is. I was like, where did we see it again? Uh... Let's see, 33 damage, so it's a little less. Each weak spot hit with the rifle increases the damage by 40%. That's what we have now. Rifle weak spot hit damage increased by 20. This one says rifle damage is increased by 100% against wounded enemies. Ooh, that is pretty good. This is good, but I don't hit weak spots that often, except for... When I hit... Ooh, I have upgrades already. What did I need for it? Silver. Oh. Punch attacks increased. Wow, linen and seashore candles. Okay. Cool. So I have to try out this rifle. I wonder what counts as wounded. Is it just when they're not full health? I guess I haven't been here. Because I've been everywhere else. I still need to explore more. Maybe I need to run into someone. Um, wait. Ah, oh, it's a rope thing. Ew, I can't get there from here. Then what do I... What have I not explored? I feel like I've been everywhere. Upgrades! Spirit recovery. Nice. Yeah, that's great. I can do this one too. Ooh. Yeah, let's do it. Level 5. Nice. Much better healing items. And we need more fur for that one. Okay. That's it. Maybe rest. Make sure I have all my healing items. I think I was short maybe one. All right. Oh, and it already says it here, too. Banish refills faster and does more damage. So this is a scourge, right? Show your shape in flesh. Oh, yeah, this is a beast. Oh, that means I should actually do the weak spot one. Um, I wonder if I can... Okay. You cannot change your encrapment in this context. Dang it. Okay. 
That doesn't do much. Should have really equipped my other weapon. I think if I know it's a beast, I should just... That a little explosion. That was only 30, 32. Oh, someone shoot. That does way more damage. Ouch. There you are. See him now. We island case for you. Spectre going for a No, I got him. So now that it ref it's weak, but it Yeah. It recharges so quickly. And then I do that. Ah! I missed! Shot, and I missed. Shot, and I didn't miss that time. Nope. Not on my watch. Ow. Ah! Stop! It's coming for you! Did I heal? I can't tell. Do a super shot and see. Look to me. I think I healed, yeah. I'm full health now. Scourge aggression. Yeah, <laughs> one skill point. Yay. <gasps> woo woo woo! I hope you guys are proud of me. I'm very happy. I felt a bit bad that I didn't see the the modifiers last time I recorded. So now that I'm actually seeing them and using them to fight better. Very happy about that. Okay, now that that's done, I think I'll just go ahead here. It might just be like it just wants us to find the way ahead. And then the mission might just update. Okay, um, I think I'll just go this way. See what's up. Farmlands. Oh yeah, now it automatically updated. Cool. Let's just have a look then at what's here. Some silver. Ooh. What in the? There's a ship here. Wow. Incredible. Beautiful too. That's awesome. Big ship. Destroy those ghost wards if you want me back. That? More? Mm, I don't see the other ones. I can help. Great. Yeah, I did it! Oh, she does increased damage right now. Ouch! Where'd you come from? To coat my wolf kills on one hand. The black and white is so cool in the wolf. Nice. <laughs> oh, wards. I felt cannot manifest. Mushroom. I need those. Okay. 
What about this dude in the middle here? Linen. Nice. Let's check the map, shall we? Ooh, there's a nice little nook over here. Let's have a look. A nice little nook. Let's have a look. Got some treasure for me, maybe. Not getting as much pyrite anymore. Now I'm getting silver. Wards, you're on your own. Picking up something spectral nearby. I think I. Oh. The ward's power is gone. Okay, good. Ooh. Oh, is that what this is? Is this a challenge area? I I could try it, but ready to walk through it if you are. Yeah, let's do it. So void traveling. Let's see if I with the knowledge of the modifiers if I can do better. <laughs> Inside of Void Breach, enemies are regenerating. Yes. Antea is stronger. Void Breaches are affected by spectral malevolence. Modifies rules of combat. Yeah. All encounters will respawn if you're defeated. Okay, so what's the modifier? I didn't really see one. Oh, maybe it's per... Ah! Each attack increases damage, resets on being ghost. hit. Okay. Oh, I'm stuck, I'm stuck! Nice! Okay, 37. Don't get hit! Don't get hit! This isn't over yet. Oh, dude. Have some of this. Stop him. Oh, big boy. Hit the guy behind him. <laughs> I didn't mean to. <laughs> okay, I haven't gotten hit yet. Sweet. But where do I go? What is that? Oh, it's just light. <laughs> Hopefully I'm going the right way. <gasps> this looks like fighting. Oh, did it reset anyway? Get back up. Uh. Those are annoying because I can get hit by that really Trouble's easy. About I know. Scary dude. Okay, just this guy now. Did we miss a few? Oh yeah, he regenerates, I forgot. Oh, that was close. Oh, one shot, one shot. Yes. Get back up. Nice. Seventy four a hit. Oh, there you are. Run. He's shooting. Take aim. Nice. Another one well done. If I do say so myself. Something here? Hmm? I don't see anything. Oh. Oh. We jumping? And we're jumping again. Oh, 
Wait, I can go left or right? There is a path once I clear the way. Ah, I see. He's cleared. Phew, so fucking badass. Wait. The way is clear. Let's go. Um, oh, this one's a little tricky. Ah. So many jumpies. This guy's on his own. Die, you bastard. Strong shot. I think I didn't get hit. Oh, I did. Dang it, reset. No matter. Ouch. Dude, I fucking almost had him. Oh, there's a super shot. Wait. Oh, I missed. Wait, still got the super shot. That was not that much of a super shot. <sighs> oh well. Ha, <laughs> that's what you get. Oh. Can't get hit though, it's gonna keep resetting me. Piss off. I gotta charge up my bar at least. Ugh. Keeps hitting me. Oh jeez! Oh jeez! Hugging all the fun. Okay. Only eight, <gasps> and he's full health. Okay. Yeah, Seventy-eight. She's doing good. Yes, you go, Antea. We going this way? I have no idea where we're going. Any progress is good progress? Question mark? Once you get some good combos without getting hit, you get so strong, but some enemy patterns I have difficulty avoiding getting hit. Man, we are climbing. Seems like a massive level with how much jumping we've done. Oh, I think I'm there. Oh, jeez, dude. Okay. That's one. Oh, something hit me. Shit. I'm trying. Get stronger, get stronger. Oh, I didn't even see that. Okay, I see lots of markers on me. Ah, oh, this guy. Ah, oh. oh, he got me. Shit. I can help. I know. Please do. Oh, I was hoping I was without reach for that. I'm right here. I can 
help. I know, I know. Help me. Oh god, so much is happening. Keep the bashing. Nice, nice. Got him, got him, got him. Now go. Um, I think we have one more. There it is. hit me. It's hard to tell. Okay. Nice. Wait, I didn't kill you? I did. Is he dead? Can't see shit. Ask for help if you need it. Yes, I do. Thank you. There. Okay. Who was that? Okay, I need to go attack this thing. Oh god, this guy here. Oh, I got it. I got it. Okay. This thing now. Yes, she was so strong. That was like two four hundred hits. Oh my god, awesome. Now I just leave, right? Wait. Power increased plus three all attributes. That's great. Whoa. Okay, I just wanted to make sure that wasn't like a another reward somewhere. We did it. That was intense. It is done. Oh, I do get a reward. Third eye. Another healing one? Vanishing increases the damage of the next punch attack by 250%. Nah, I like this one better. Now, where am I? Oh, this is complicated looking. Uh, how did I even get here? I was here! Oh, I came out somewhere completely else. I see. Let's upgrade. Ooh! I got a level. Hmm. One of these, maybe? Rifle hits refill the bandage gauge. Weak spot hits... Refill it even more, but weak spot hit damage is reduced. Hmm. But if I refill the banish gauge quicker, and then every shot while the banish gauge is full, 300%. I might go with this, because I don't hit the weak spots all the time. And I do do the 300% shot if the bandage gauge is full. So the quicker it fills up, the more I do the super shot. Let's do that. Void splinters. Bog iron. Let's do it. Relic. Oh. Wait, I can do it! Rank 7 healing shot. Goddamn! Awesome! Awesomeness! I am here, apparently. Oh, that's how I got the Void Splinter. Gotcha. This concept art. Whoever made this concept art is a genius artist. So good. That's wallpaper worthy shit. 
Oh yeah, the sheep, so cool. I wonder why it's still red on my map. Does that mean anything? Or can I just do it? Is it like end endless? I was just gonna, or is it endless? Like I could keep doing it, and then it just says in the name that it's endless. Ooh, hop on. More efficient than cannon powder. What is this way? Oh, wait, what? I was here already. Wasn't I? Spectre heading for that corpse. Eh. Ah, did I not make it? How did you get in there so quickly? I, feel like a bloody I don't like those practice. quick little guys. Out of it. These guys. I don't like you. There. At least her punches are quick. So maybe she's better for those guys. And that then is gonna shoot. he is good for this guy. And this guy. Die, you bastard. And what bow? <laughs> Take that. Oh yeah, now I'm here again. Away with you. Hmm. Okay, well got a little bit of XP. Now I will take my leave. Apparently I go this way for the question mark. Wait. Oh. Some serious business going on over here. Hello, friends. These body parts scream manifest my spectre. <laughs> Thanks for telling me. I will do that. Oh, I can't. Oh, I'm missing seashore candles. Maybe... Mm, since we're at a seashore, maybe I can find some. Yep. Boop, boop. Seashore candles! What is this? What does it say? Kronos? What a name. I like it. It's very unusual. What is it? What to your spirit I see? Anything here? Oh! Hmm, I really hope I learn that ability soon. Okay, let's see if we can do the spectre. Present yourself! Look to me! It's the best! <laughs> it's actually the best! Oh! Ooh, there was a big guy in there! Ooh, didn't expect that! Look out! What? Oh! I have a super shot. Oh god. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Super shots ready. Let's go. Troubles about. I know. <laughs> and boom! Standing by. <laughs> yeah, you're on standby. I don't need you. Pretty good with a rifle. <laughs> oh, moss. <gasps> I can't collect you, but you're so pretty. Dang it. Ooh, is this a different entrance? It is. Hello. Ooh, nice. I need these. Okay, I really have to pee. Ah, 
I can be ignored no longer. A sight to behold. Wasn't I always? Hmm. Okay, so this should help with the clearing up that root thing. I think it's like we need to be able to see both at the same from the same vantage point. So one will be here and the other will be Oh! Big bones! The other is here somewhere. <gasps> Through here, probably. Yeah. Okay, that's something for later then. A fishing boat, eh? Because that's more plausible than a galleon. Hmm. What is this? Creeping ivy up ahead. Oh. Yeah, the more that I can't deal with. Can I go here? No. Well, at least I made some stairs. So that was the big ship. What is my objective here? Explore. Hmm. I haven't explored this part of the ship yet, and then I guess we should just press on again. Linen. Hey, now I can take the moss. Hehe. <laughs> Pretty flowers. like much else big bones that must be well bones right hmm. okay i guess now we go down the trail oh oh i'm allowed to yeah now i'm allowed to grab it <laughs> A flame. Okay, so that was this bit. Yeah, I guess I just go back and take a right. Here we go! Whatever grip it is the nightmare has here, you'd never know by looking. Hmm. More linen. Okay. Ooh, we're coming up on a town. Awesome. Go to the Harrow's Hamlet. Yes, sir, game, sir. Something's nearby. Where is it? Mm. It's a body. Ghastly concretion. Silver. A bridge. The bridge is up. Wonder why. To keep folk in or to keep something out? Hmm. Can't lower it from this side. That looks so cozy. Look at that what beautiful little cottage. Here? Time to work, Banisher. What is lurking nearby? I don't see anything. Is it? Oh, there you are. Can I cross here? Don't want to get your clothes wet, huh? Let's see then. Hmm. Wait, but if I can't cross the bridge, maybe I can see. Ah, the thing from here. And I missed. And I try again. This time I hit. Oh, I need to hit both sides. Oops. 
I wanted to jump it. Mm -hmm. Yep. Well, now everything can get in, including me. Ha. Oh, look at the rope sway. Nice. I do want to check out this cozy little cabin, though. Can I move in here? I like it. Minus the dead wolf in the back. Why did I suddenly press R to reload? There he is. Lynn. Hello? Anyone home? No? Then I will take this house. House red. Cool! Oh, and that opened the door! Sweet. Um, the village I grew up in, speaking of, like, mills. It's not a windmill, obviously, but it made me think of it. Um, I'd, it never occurred to me until much later in my life how rare it is that the village I grew up in still had a working windmill that made flour. And they wouldn't, it wouldn't, like, work all the time, because it's, it's like a windmill from the 17, 1800s. So it's very... It needs to be preserved. But as a kid, one time we went up to it and we bought flour that was made in the windmill to make bread. And as a kid, you don't even realize how rare something like that is to, to get. I was just like, okay, so we got flour. So what? <laughs> I was really young, mind you. I was like seven or eight, I think. Now in hindsight, I'm like, man, that's so cool. I wish I actually paid attention to like what the inside of the windmill looked like. The village is full of ghost wards. They're afraid of something. Well, let's get rid of Leave them. Leave them up. Oh. Cause no trouble. Well, I was gonna shoot them. Hello! So Hello. many ghost wards. Anyone home? Where did they go? What is this? General store. It looks like stuff is stocked. Where are they? Are they hiding somewhere? The well, recently sealed. Below, it feels off. Ooh. Smells off too. Shoe repairs. Anything here? Well, there should be a campfire here. Locked for now, though. Hmm. Where do I go? Oh, this seems like an important building. Behind me, up the hill. Oh, I can't go... Okay. The game is making me take a certain route. The Bible. Help. Is the Bible still the most printed book in the world? Probably right. Fairfax Haskell. Though it bring demons down in great wrath upon my soul, do pray for those tongues and hearts fixed fair on the fires of hell. That from their Friends, hey. find fortitude in our success. Dude, it's been a while. Exiled from our homes by the devil's machinations, we congregate before the Lord in this new meeting house. Mm. We gather, we worship, we overcome. 
They tried to relocate. And we shall be well protected by the holy ward my son now makes under my instruction. For I have spent hours countless in your service, pouring through books and papers, devouring the oeuvre of my peers, that our meeting house be safe. Fairfax Haskell, for whom the word pompous was invented. Half built? Yes. Open to the four winds. Yes, but already it is resplendent with our faith. A shining reminder of our renewed belief in better days. Hi, still alive. McCraith, Mr. McCraith. <laughs> I thought you... I thought you... What happy portent, what most excellent news. What blessings. I applaud your valorous deeds. O oh, fate, I say, dead sir, I thought you oh, were dead. Maybe I am. Do not make light of such matters, my friend, for the devil's wrath is wide awake, and his claw scratches at our door, metaphorically speaking. I'm alive. I promise. My friends, I shall deliver this sermon another time. The battle with the Devil's Legions is ongoing, and Mr. McCraith and I have much to discuss. We sure do. He didn't seem very happy with me surviving. I wonder why. Thank you, Lammy. Well, it's nice to see that the Behold, ghost wards are actually miracle working. miracle of ours, Mr. McCraith. Exiled we, yet in our darkest hour, we find the moral vigor to build this humble monument to resilience. But you and I must speak of darker matters. For we, erudite men of higher learning, erudite. know that evil yet walks. There is much work to be done. Indeed there is. This is yes, my ring. Yes. Forgive the inelegance <laughs> of my welcome. Do you like it? You Solid are alone. Gold. Do I surmise that Miss Duarte is no I'm more? I'm kind of rich around these parts of town. Um, she knew the risks. She knew the risks. So will I go in unto the king. And if I perish, I perish. So said Esther to Mordecai. Such wisdom. Such courage. I'm so sorry for your loss. Grief is a journey, long and painful, but you do not walk the road alone, I promise you. Mm, that's nice. There comes a time when you must let go and walk on alone. In time, God healed my wounds. May you two find peace. Now, I regret that even at this most burdensome time for you, I must move with haste to business and beg once more for your help. What's going on? It must be serious if you're asking for my help. Since your defeat at the meeting house, the devil, heartened and emboldened, goes from strength to strength. He insinuates himself among my people, reveling in the suffering of the disease he unleashes upon us. It pits one against the other. Suspicion tears this community apart once again. All this to weaken my people and lead them away from the light of God. Hmm. In times of disease, you need doctors, and I'm no doctor. We'll not treat the symptoms, we'll tear out the root. An agent of the devil walks among us. A witch! You must find her, or him, as it may be. Hmm. You and I share great expertise, but I am a man of position. Well, you, sir, are much more familiar with field work. Go, meet my people, walk amongst them, learn which of them secretly serves the demon, that we may expunge this evil malady from our body politic. Okay. What makes you think there's a witch at work here? 
Aye, sir, I'm a man of God and intellect. I can read the signs. When a so paranoia, mystery you mean? disease afflicts half of my people overnight, there can be only one culprit. Tis the devil's doing, sir. Probably through one of his servants. For you see, I understood immediately that the water in the well had been tainted. There are no strangers here. You could self-accept it. No one has fled. The guilty woman, or man, I suppose, remains within the village. As evil walks, the evil are emboldened, but this witch shall see her downfall. Or his, of course. <laughs> as did the last one. As will the next. The last one? You Some mean the nightmare? Ago, you may have heard tell of this. I made my name on the execution of a terrible witch. Mm -hmm. It pains me that I must do it once more. This illness, tell me of it. Upon my arrival here in the Harrows, I immediately set about protecting the place with consecrated tokens. Safeguarded from the curse, we all felt safer for a time. Then some devil poisoned the well, our only source of water, someone on the inside, mind. Spoiled water proves nothing. Yeah, couldn't it just be spoiled? I was just thinking well that. Well made, Banisher, if not for the fact that we have been, for months on end, under the obvious influence of a terrible curse. One way or another, the devil has found an agent among us. Mm. And who knows what nefarious, ill-doing old black spy plans next. About your wards. I noted your ghost wards, with some interest. Ghost wards, an interesting name. I call them Sanctifiers, a name more palatable to my flock. Sanctity. This requires a great deal of occult knowledge. Where did you learn your craft? The sun is making... Etienne Roulet, one of the greatest demonologists of our time, is a good friend of mine. I improved upon his work. Damn. Why did you not use them in New Eden when the curse began? It was more complicated to convince the whole congregation of the necessity mm. to use magic. Here, people have more trust in my unmovable probity. I see. A man in your position must know what goes on in his own community. Why, of course, I know all that there is to know. Or near enough. What, the Ask population question, of five, sir. you mean? Ask away. <laughs> How goes the colony? Sir, the body politic bears a heavy weight. Not content with weakening their flesh, the devil's evil attacks the people's hearts and minds. Until you expose the culprit, the harmony of this divinely beautiful commonwealth shall remain marred by suspicion and mistrust. He's so fanciful with his Long words. Long story shortened. People are not getting along. Yeah, I mean, obviously. How did you, a man of position and faith, become a, a demonologist? Ah, yes. If you'll indulge me for a moment, I shall explain in the briefest manner possible. Mm -hmm. Though blessed What's the with intellect and no little faith, I also had privilege. I had the means for an education, time and place with which to study. For a time, my father was a pupil of Henry Boggart, the great demonologist. Oh, so his dad studied he had the books. too. I had the aptitude. When he passed, I donned his mantle. Hmm. My father taught me about duty. I have gifts, faith, intellect, position. I must protect them. I must use them to protect my people. This is my duty. This so lofty. is my burden. Damn, dude. Didn't ask for a speech, Your but... son. How would you describe him? Lamentation. How would I describe him? I... Well, he's curious. Inquisitive, I mean, as opposed what if to it's peculiar. His own son? Although he has his moments there, too. I tried to teach him demonology. To make him the third generation of witch hunters. Ah, but he revealed no disposition. Occult knowledge could only obfuscate his good nature. At heart, 
He is a naive boy who reads a lot and doesn't say much. Hmm, I wonder if he's the witch. I am no witch hunter. My business is with the lingering dead. For a fee, yes, I know. But you can't deny evil practitioners exist. A few years ago, I had to cleanse this community from such a threat. Hmm. Why would she curse your colony? Why would anyone choose to separate from God's flock? I'm afraid some just want to see the world burn, Mr. McCraith. By the grace and charity of the good Lord, she was exposed. Mm -hmm. It was my honor to serve him in sending her to hell where she belonged. Her mask was a good one, as if butter would not melt upon her tongue. But she cannot fool a man of faith and intellect. No, sir, you cannot. You'll not mind me saying it, but for a Puritan paradise, you seem to get more than your fair share of witches. God has not forsaken us, but someone here does the devil's work. Find me a witch, Mr. McCraith. Return this place to the Lord. Aren't you the witch hunter, then? I'm a working man, Governor, but the Lord does seem happy to pay, so I'll do what I can. Hmm. I'll take my leave of you, Governor. Of governor. course. Outside, you must take the stairs. While you're with us, the first house on the left shall be your home. Cool. Thank you. Another witch hunt. Another false accusation, you mean? Mm -hmm. Another blight on the lives of women. First house on the left. Must be the one with the campfire, right? Can we move down here now? Yeah, the stuff has moved. Nice. If you need help, I'm not busy. Oh, hi, dude. Son, He's right? so nice. I, uh, yes, sir. Lamentation cool Haskell. glasses. Friends call me Lammy. Lammy. Oh, they would if I had any. Please, call me Lammy. Hee <laughs> hee. I have so many questions, sir. So many questions. But I suspect this is not the time. No. Not the time. But perhaps you may help me anyway. Me? Why, if I can help, I'd be honored. I wonder what's on the necklace. Oh, lots of questions. So tell me, Lammy, what do you do? What a nice nickname, uh, Lammy. What? How do you spend your days? I assist my father, especially with the ghost wards. That keeps me very busy. When I can, I continue my research into the mysteries of life. Wildlife, mostly. If I can find any. Those that aren't dead have left New Eden. Who can blame them? Hmm. Must be hard, being the governor's son and all. Is it? I don't know. I've never been anyone else's son. <laughs> hard to grow up in his shadow, I would have thought. Only if you like the attention, not me. I just want to read books and learn stuff. People leave me alone, mostly. I like that. Mostly. What about the illness? Your father spoke of the pestilence. He did? Then, sir, you know as much as I do. If you have an opinion of your own, I'd be glad to hear it. Since you ask it, I believe a thing most vile assails us. An evil of origin unknown and perhaps unknowable. So the pestilence is part of the curse? Uh, y yes. Of course, the curse. Of course it's the curse. What else could it be? Mm hmm. That was a bit Those weird. Those words are quite unique. They are, aren't they? Conceived by Etienne Roulet, but made by my father. Do you use them as well in your line of work? Not really. I mostly talk to ghosts. I don't repel them. Of course. Still, each tool has its purpose, and these troubled times, we need all the tools we can get. Magic is glorious when wielded by the righteous. Mm, glorious. You seem to know a lot about it. Uh, oh, if only, sir, if only. I'm still learning. Many of the subtleties and nuances escape me yet. Whoa, what was that? 
Your father believes there is a Harrow's Witch. Have you noticed anyone acting strange? I... I'd answer, sir, I surely would, only things being as they are, everyone is acting strange. Mm. The curse brought illness, illness brought division, division has led to strife. We could do with some healing, sir, we could. We need you to bring us peace. Okay. Good day to you, Lammy. Good day to you, sir. So when I rest here, am I on my Ghost own? Ghost ward. I think you can safely knock it over. <gasps> the ward's power is gone. Key to the deceased and heaven's personal belongings. Oh, nice. New Eden, a long oh, winter. Did I already write about the winter that never ended? Sometimes I lose track of time. This is the reason why I keep these pages until the day I've I'll give them to the wind, to witness what happened to us. 1694. Sickness was upon us. Chicken died first, then the calves and lambs. Crops were bad in the summer. Autumn was gray and cold. Old people started to die. I remember, I think it was in October when we buried the Hutchinson. A whole family taken by the disease in two days, children and ad adults alike. Then there was the fire on the docks. Or was it before? It's hard to remember anymore. Fear rose and the decision was made to send the children away, by precaution. The governor Haskell ordered the children to be sent away. Thick-skinned Newsmith and Nicholas Doolan agreed to, agreed to lead the young ones to Boston. It was in December. I remember it because I wrote a long page in my journal that day. The 7th of December. Cold was already terrible then. It only went worse since. Spring never came. According to my notes, we already are in May and snow and ice is everywhere. Our only visitor for all these months is that French friend of the governor, Etienne Roulet, and even him cannot leave now. Minister Davenport has ceased to conduct prayers and guidance in the meeting house. The survivors are all hungry and cold. Soon some help should arrive by boat. Banishers from Europe. I wonder if they will be ever able to leave like the rest of us. Lucy P. Okay. That it. Another Bible. Another Bible. This will be a good place to take a rest. Let's have a look around town. Maybe there's a haunting here or there. Oh, they're open now. Phoebe Walcutts and Lucy Barrows. Yeah, let's see now that we can go into the buildings. What they have to offer. Maybe we can buy some mushrooms. Or the... The other coast one, because I'm low on that. Ah, there is something behind... Hello. And what about that? The governor's speech was so inspiring. A Good day to you both. And a good day to you too, sir. Hello. And wasn't that quite the entrance you made? I sure we was. Talk with the town. So, what brings you to our wee corner of the world? Wee corner. The governor bade me make the rounds. He suspects evil doing. If it's evil doing you're after, you may turn around and hurry back to New Eden Town. Now, if it excuse us, my sister's not feeling well, and we must hurry home. Dear Eve, I didn't catch your name. God be with you in your terrible pronunciation. Mary Claire O'Hara. This is my sister, Elizabeth. Mm, oh, well. You wanted to go? I have tons of questions. What do you do? What do you do around here? We raise livestock. Or at least, we used to. When they we were still alive. We lost witch's curse. And the curse still stands, does it not? Banisher. Sure does. What happened to the farm? Sickness took Elizabeth's sheep, and I can weave nothing without wool. Hmm. Where are you from? Ireland? It's pleasant to meet another Gale. Where in Ireland are you from, exactly? We left Clarenbridge for Boston many years ago. How's life with the English? We're all the same saints under God, sir, and we too are New Englanders now. After seven years in service, we've earned our place here. 
Weren't the no, American we quite racist against Ir Irish people? You have plants as need gathering? Back in the 1800s? The pain. I mean, obviously, All I know it's after 1600s, but... The in the world will not help this fever, I fear. We need no help from the godless. Thank you very much. Our Damn. fate guides and protects us. I seem to remember I read a history book on New York. It said that the Italians and the Irish were really, like, poorly... Of course, black people. Um, but they were poorly treated. From where comes the fever? <sighs> a bad cut that's spoiled. Tis not your concern. She's dangerously sick. Either she doesn't know it, or she knows it and is hiding it. Hmm. And now you really must be going. We'll take up no more of your time. I insist. I'll let you rest, so. Slan live. Goodbye to you. Would you pray with us, Mr. McCrate? Elizabeth. God hath numbered my kingdom. Whatever my sister may believe, I've not long now. Please, pray with us. So she knows it. Sure. I surely will. Get in their it. good graces. Pray for healing, Mr. McGrath. No, pray for peace. Hmm. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Earth. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. May the road rise to you, Elizabeth O'Hara. Worry not about me. I'll be in heaven long before the devil knows I'm dead. <laughs> Elizabeth O'Hara, don't tempt him. God be with you, Red McRae, and a good day now. Hmm. Sorry, ladies. The famed and famous banisher, the one and only Red Mac. This is carrying a whistle. Have we met? I was at the meeting house. You've got guts. I like that. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, politeness gives me the shits. <laughs> I buy and sell. Now then, what's your pleasure? What you got? Show me your wares. May I see your wares? I'm a shopkeeper, aren't I? Yes, you may see my wares. What is that? Orpheus's tear. Hitting an enemy with a manifestation increases the damage of the next light attack and heavy attack by 50%. With a manifestation? The lucky star. Defeating an enemy with melee increases the damage of the next manifestation by 70. Carica's stone. Spirit points gains are increased by 30%, but manifestation cooldowns increased by 30. Hmm. Linen, a leather, a fur. Ooh, I needed fur. Wool. And a cash. I'll take the map. And I'll take these. Don't know how much I need. Oh, that only costs me 80? I'll take it all then. Okay, cool. What can you tell me about the community here? Like who? Governor. I bet you tell me what you know of Governor Haskell. That kind, kind man. He's been so good to me. Hmm. He's all vapor and bounce. Lammy. Lammy Haskell. Any thoughts about him? Him? He's so deep in his father's shadow, you'd barely know he were there. Hmm. And how are you? I'm doing my best to bring a little joy to the world. What with all the gloom. And how's that going for you? Badly. <laughs> Have you been trading in New Eden long? Forever and a day, your Highlander Highness. I belong to this land, body and soul. And can no longer tell where I end and it begins. Really? Huh? <laughs> of course not. Don't be so gullible. Life makes more sense to the cynic. 
sense of humour won't go missed, neither. Folk here are too grim to notice how charming and funny I am. <laughs> I'm eight years, if you must know, of the third settlement. I was one of the first to arrive. And look how far we've come since. So, have you noticed any strange behaviour of late? Apart from my own, yes. So much so that now I am almost normal. Caleb Watson, for example. Now he, my friend, is really strange. Hmm. Is he now? He used to be such a nice man. Now he's aggressive and he smells like the Christmas cat at Easter. <laughs> Sounds charming. Christmas cat at Easter? Thank you. Till we meet again. You mind your good self, dear. Can I look behind? I want to go. I want to go in here. Maybe later. Give us this day our daily bread, our bread, not our ale, our bread. Do you want us to starve? I should have the yeast. You know it, Mistress Barrow. You know it full well. If you want yeast, then grow your own. Just stick some in a jar and grow it, and you'll have it forever. Now there is none. And it's my fault. Food is a staple, and drink is a luxury. Give me the yeast. How many different ways do you need to hear it? Of yeast, there is no more. There is yeast, no more. Yeast? No, no more. There's no more shitting yeast. You're lying. You're breaking <laughs> now, Mr. Cottle, and I am vexed. Go home. Go back to your work. Go to hell for all I care. Just go away. Good day, yeah. sir. Good day, uh, madam. Mistress. Lucy, Lucy Barrow, Barrow, the alewife. Red McGrath, the banisher. Alewife, is it? I'd never have guessed from looking at you. And what does an alewife yeah, look like, Yeah, I was just Mr. thinking banisher? that. She's got you there. Tell me about yourself, about your work. Unfazed. <laughs> what are you, the census taker? I'm Lucy Barrow. I'm earnest, proud, clever. I'm a widow of 41. My husband and I ran a tavern in England. I was the brains, he was... Well, he was there. <laughs> and if you call me Widow Barrow, I'll fetch my shears and dock your chestnuts. <laughs> wow. What brought you to New Eden? <laughs> okay. Freedom. Prosperity. The chance to watch good Puritan men drink till they are sick, even as they fill my purse. And chestnuts. I came for chestnuts. <laughs> now I happen to know that the alewife hears stories others don't. So, what's new? Want a story, do you? All right. Recently, I saw Phoebe Walcott walking strangely. She was hiding something under her coat. I don't know what it was, but she went into her barn, and when she came out, she no longer had it. Hmm. I've seen her repeat the deed on several occasions. Not that I'm counting, nor that I care. Okay, interesting. How's life in the Harrows? As sweet as you would wish. When is life as sweet as one could wish? Well, that depends on how you define sweetness. Sweeter ale sells better, but the sweetness makes it weaker. Hmm. Tell me about the governor. Not a big ale drinker, I imagine. Why not? Sadly, no. He has a beer belly. Hello. Perhaps if he had been, he might not have been such an arseworm. He's a man afraid of me, an educated woman. He hmm. pries. Comes calling to check the contents of my pot. He's afraid. A scared little man. Huh. I am a woman of brains and means. But despite that, nay, because of it, I fear the witch hunt. I was just gonna say, don't show too much personality or they might come after you. What can you tell me about Lamentation Haskell? Lammy. I hardly know him. He doesn't talk much. I suspect he's smart, but it's hard to tell. 
I'm honestly He's still suspicious bored. of Lammy the most. Adorable, of course, but hardly interesting. Okay. Show me your wares. Would you be interested in the trade at all? What do you need? What have you got? Oh, she has a lot. She has mushrooms. Silver. Wow. Yeah, I'll get these mushrooms because I don't have a lot. How much is... Oh, 800. I could get 35. Nice. Can I ask, have you noticed anything strange lately? If you have, be sure to tell me. I'll be sure to tell you if I see anything normal. <laughs> Strange is the flavor of the hour, the week, the month, and the year. Yet folks still gossip. They're suspicious, aggressive, impatient. Perhaps they hanker for normality. I suppose it figures. Well, if you hear anything that strikes you as unusual, do let me know. Okay, that's it. I'll Goodbye. take my leave of you for now. Have a good day, sir. Who's this guy praying in the background? Oh, where are you going? Red McCraith, sir. The Banisher, at your service. May I ask your name? Bachelor. Hugh Bachelor. Bachelor? I was the school teacher here in New Eden. Mm. In the times before. When there were I do still not kids. need the services of a heretic today. And nor do the people of New Eden. He seems pleasant. Hmm. What does a teacher do with no kids to teach? Teaching, sir, takes preparation. At some point in the future, the roads will open and the children will return, and I, sir, shall be prepared. Sure. Why didn't you leave okay. with the kids? For some time, I wished I had. Watching the children walk away near broke my heart. For many weeks, I was lost. But the Lord had other plans for me. I know it now. And they hmm. are? You shall see for yourself soon enough that you may bear witness. Oh, okay. Is that a what threat? What around and about? I'll make no report to a troublemaker like you. He doesn't like me. Seen anything strange of late? Do you speak of the disease eating at the fabric of our fair community? Mm -hmm. We've sealed the well closed homes and houses and said our prayers it has not worked apart from that have you noticed anyone behaving strangely i have to ask i have seen the alewife mistress barrow lurking by the well hands hmm. in her pockets clutching at her herbals and as i think of it before his house burned down with his wife and brother in it Caleb Watson and the alewife had a sharp exchange of words. It were as if she'd cursed him. If there is a Harrow's Witch, I'd start looking there. Hmm. If I wanted a word with her, where would I find her? Right, you just she talked to her. She to the alehouse, brewing God knows what witchery and mischief in her cauldron. Hmm, okay. I must take my leave of you, sir. God keep you. But I shall not. Um, Caleb Watson. We keep hearing that name. It's justice. Start anew. Shout on these people. They can't hurt us. But how could you make him kiss it again? Oh, there. Is he sick? He Are looks you sick. Alright, sir. We're closed. Uh, oh, now. Now would you leave? Leave. I can tell from your sorry demeanour that you won't mind me asking you a couple of questions. I'm Red McCraith. I'm a banisher. I'm searching the area for evidence of witchcraft. And you, I can tell, are itching to help me. Show your shite and shapes, goose peddler. No witches here. Only oh, myself. you're Caleb Watson. Caleb Watson. Tell me a tale. What have you heard round about lately that might be of interest? Gossips for shite bags. Not being a shite bag, I don't gossip. The governor bade me make the rounds. Is anyone acting strange? 
Why would he ask you that? Everyone keeps secrets. And I have a talent for uncovering them. <laughs> I ain't got no secrets. I ain't done no wrong. Search me house, if you don't believe me. See for yourself. And when you're done, if you're any kind of man, you'll come back here, doff your cap, apologize, then shite off and never come back. Hmm. If you're looking for someone acting strangely, I think you've found your man. I'll be leaving you alone for now. A man content with his own company is never alone. <laughs> you hear that? Good one, right? This is wrong. It's wrong, wrong, I tell you. Fascinating. Does each citizen have their own? What do you think? Two of them are missing. Alexander and Ruth Watson. Hmm. Mm. Family? Don't mind if I snoop around, do you? Dear Mr. Watson, I'm responding to your letter regarding my abilities. I'm delighted to know that we share the same interests, and it would be very nice to be able to meet with you to discuss the subject. Indeed, I would like to know more about the extent of your knowledge and your technical abilities. However, if possible, I would like to meet you somewhere quiet and secluded, away from those who would monger scandal, as I know that the work of an artist can excite emotions, especially if not correctly understood. People are rarely objective, and I would not want this to taint the professionalism of our interview. I look forward to hearing from you soon. Your friend and fellow craftsman. <laughs> Feels terrible. Dear Mr. Watson, I herewith write you to write to you personally to thank you for your diligence, application, and hard work towards building a new future for the company. Mastery of a craft is, as I'm sure you know, a sign of godliness and as sure as day follows night, a village of well-shot parishioners is a sure sign of the Lord's prosperity. Fairfax Haskell. Take your linen, if you don't mind. Door key. Mistress Walcott, I write in all kindness to remind your, you gently of our understanding bill, outstanding bill for the repairs done in your boots. Late payment serves no one, you must know it, and this is not the first time you've left me hanging. Perhaps you would be so kind to, as to pay your bills of a morning before you open your bottle. Damn. Ruthless. So why did I get a door? Oh, another one. Fear not. I know it was you, Alexander's angry letter. I know you've been spreading all these rumors. I know you told Ruth that I broke my promise. What the hell's wrong with you? You broke my reputation. My life, my future. You stabbed me, your own brother, in the back. Your own blood. Do you know what would our parents say if they knew? They would repudiate? Like you, the stinking rat you are. You don't deserve to bear the Watson name. To the gutter with you, you dog. I'll make it my life's work to make yours hell, and when I die, I'll haunt you. Okay. Wait, there's stuff behind there. Oh, can I squeeze by? Ruth, I have long considered sending you this letter at all, as I can only imagine how it will make you suffer. But I believe that an omission of the truth is a lie in the eyes of God, and so a sin, even if pretending nothing is wrong would be easier on us all. Alexander is unfaithful. He sees harlots behind your back. There, the truth is out. I have long been familiar with Alexander's depravity. He might be charming and quick-witted, but his soul is defective and God has rejected him. No matter that what the town might want to say t about you, I know that you are pure. I know your soul untouched, bright, and godly. I admire your grace and the purity of your heart as revealed in your words and your actions. The world fades around your presence and my love is ever growing. My home is always open to you, dear Ruth, as is my heart. Being courted by two brothers at once rarely ends well. Personal experience. Don't go there. <laughs> A medallion. Engraved with the initials RW. Very poor condition. Hmm. Fear not. You'll bugger off soon. They both will. Ah, there we go. Ah, I used the key. Is he hiding something in the back? 
You bachelor said Lucy Barrow cursed the house and it burned down. The house burned down, and I suspect the rest is nonsense. Hmm. What's Bones. this? It's not metal, not wood. Bone. It's bone. Lovely. Who is he keeping back here? Hear ye, the deaths and subsequent funerals have taken place of Alexander Watson and Ruth Watson, wife and brother to shoemaker Caleb Watson. Wait, so Ruth was married to Caleb? Both dead tragically in the fire at the Watson house and buried with dignity before Caleb and his friend and neighbors in the eyes of the Lord of God's at God's Acre. Ruth is remembered as a devoted wife and a kind and gentle presence in our company. Alexander is remembered as a troubled man, oft bottle bound, who caused much vexation and was given to great sin, yet who redeemed himself at the end by rushing heedless into the flames in a futile effort to save his sister-in-law. We pray for their acceptance at the right hand Ruth of God. Ruth and Alexander Watson, the cobbler's wife and brother. Mm -hmm. He's surely haunted, but where's the ghost? It's ours anyway. I think we need to talk to Caleb Watson. It's been ours since the beginning. You know it's true. Let's have a talk. You done enough sniffing? Hmm? Tired of the smell of your own ass? You said you had no secrets. That was a lie, am I right? Everyone has secrets. I can smell your secrets from here, mate. A pox on you. And a pox on your questions, too. Hmm. You'll not take him head on. You must take your time. Outflank him. There's burned debris out back. I found bone in it. Where does it come from? You must have little business if you spend your time sifting through my rubbish. It came from the house. Probably. I read your letter to Ruth. It's clear you loved her. Were you telling the truth about Alexander's infidelity? My name is Caleb Watson. And before God and all present, I swear that the letter I wrote to Ruth was a load of shite. What? Lusting for his beloved Ruth, I set out to ruin Alexander's name. Cause I'm a greedy little prick. Huh. You're frank. You don't sound like you regret it though. No. The past the past. Dead and buried. My brother is but a lingering memory. Hmm. It was terrible what happened to your wife and brother. Might have helped if you'd mentioned that. You must be grieving. Do you mind if I ask where they're buried? Shite on me, shite bag brother. And shite on you too. <laughs> they're both deep in the dirt up at God's Acre. And I'll speak no more of it. What's going on at God's Acre, Caleb? Shite off with your God's <laughs> Acre. And good riddance to both. God's Acre concerns you not. You need to tell me what happened here. Stop hiding. Nothing happened. I buried. I buried all. Quiet, you. And you can shite off. Is he possessed? Taking your nothing happened with you. Hmm. Whatever happened, it happened at God's Acre. Where is that? Do we have it on the map? Not really. Oh, we do. Let's go have a look, shall we? At this God's Acre. His portrait was really cool. Oh yeah, I forgot we were in a no ghost zone. Thoughts on Caleb? You first, young man. Mm, possessed. Talking to Caleb felt like talking to a group. I'm thinking possession. Possession is plausible, but the clues are confusing. We jump to no conclusions. Instead, we gather proof. I like that. I agree. Hmm. Perhaps there's a key. Well, let's look ahead first. Maybe that's for later. Go 
God's acre. Hold on. Okay. God's acre. Hmm. So the bridge only opens from the other side. Again. This rock formation looks weird. I guess it's normal. Well, I guess we gotta go the long way around. <laughs> Coming, my love. Hi. Yeah, still can't see anything. Got some silver, I see. Can't even ma imagine finding an actual outcrop of silver like that. So big. I watched one or two episodes way back on Discovery Channel of those back when I still had TV in the Netherlands. Of like those people who um, go gem hunting. Oh, there's definitely... But it was so dramatized that I was like, I feel like you guys are just like burying these gems yourself so that you can look cool on TV to discover them. <laughs> you know? I don't know. I don't trust TV anymore, I guess. I'm too jaded. Let us find the graves of Alexander and Ruth. Ah. And whatever got Kate up acting so strange. Okay. I assume I have to fight first. No? No ghosts? Oh yeah, there we go. Someone shooting? Oh yeah. I feel like a bloody target. Oh, got him. Okay, where are they? Got that. Got that. Watch out. Got that. And. Got that. Oh, that was so cool. <laughs> that was satisfying. Is that a female? I think I see a patella. Patella. Nutella. I would love a Nutella. Nutella. Have you guys ever had a Nutella latte? Oh my god. So tasty. Pre robbers. Yes. But what exactly were they stealing? Yeah, it was usually jewelry, gold teeth, and the like, right? Gold fillings. Oh, hey! A little doll thing. There must be a cursed box here. Ruth Watson. There's another the grave farmer. beneath it. What, here? Hmm. Where is the box? Hmm, wherever it is. I haven't found it yet. I think I heard the sound of a gun cocking. You sure did. Ready and waiting. Don't need to worry. Oops. Sorry, Grave. If undertakers did this, they should find other work. <laughs> I doubt there's a job on Earth that suits whatever did this. Yeah, who? Wait, it's like that the ground collapse, and that's why these graves are 
Above the surface, or would someone dig up everything? Oh, bunny. Decoys to distract wayward specters. Rudimentary. Someone's had a little training. Hmm. Here did lie Watson. Alexander Watson. Did Caleb take their bodies? <gasps> Someone did. And he's at the top of my list. Hmm. Well, they made quite the mess. Perhaps the decoys make sure the way. Follow the path. Don't get too close. I try. Okay, back we go. Well. Try and keep an eye out for farmer dolls as well. Maybe you should go up there. This way. More of them. Oh, that's the way to go. Okay, well, come back later. Mm hmm. Okay, I'm gonna go around the right side because there's a little space here. Oh, no. Maybe a little further. You think you can escape me? He is. She's better for this guy because she's That's quicker punches. Yeah. I said, don't get too close. What's going on over here, huh? Some silver. Nice. Okay, now I want to check this other outcropping. Hello. Can I join in too? Eventually. Right. I'm gonna stick around the left side. Man, that works so much better. There's just like certain enemies that she's much better for than he is, and vice versa. Demonology. I should have known. Hmm. Just put a rope down. Oh, there is a rope already. Then where does that lead? To the area we need to be at. Oh, I guess I can't go down here at all. Okay, I go down. Check here first. Oh, ho, ho, ho. big beautiful chest. Hello. Nice. Oh, seashore candles. Nice. Seashells. She sells. Seashore candles by the seashore. God, I'm so bad at that. That's a little harvester. Whoa, dude! Woohoo! How's that? <laughs> How's that, huh? Big hefty shot. Ooh. He's a big boy. Now the fight's getting interesting. Run. I forgot that my shots also recharge my banisher gauge. Ooh, birdie! Hey, birdie! Ouch! This is an oh, I missed! 
god, he's scary. Oh, I wasn't sprinting for some reason. Watch it. That harvester switched form. Physical to spectral. They do that. Run. Ooh. Okay. Attack! I'll get you eventually. What's he doing? Oh, birds. How is that only 78? It's supposed to be like my super strike. Get him! A vicious nice. scourge that despises the living. Great. In these lands, what a surprise indeed. Bigger mortis. What is that? A new brooch? Wait, what is this one? Punch attack increased by 5% to outburst area of effect size increased by 70%. Ooh, I do like outbursts. Cool. Shrines now? With bones? It's like Lady Blackwood's boudoir around here. Shreds of a memory linger here. Mm, who is this? Is this the brother? Oh, fella. You nasty, aren't you? Nasty, yes. But also shoddy. It's very poor work. So, ooh, parchment. Ink stained parchment. Ah, oh, I'm missing something. Are you sure we didn't miss anything? With a bit of luck, we'll find what we need. Oh, that was pretty thorough. Yeah. Hmm. Examine the shrine. Wait, where where am I now? Where am I headed? I haven't been here before, right? Let's just check around for items first. Mm, nothing. There we go. That's good. Something's nearby. Where is it? There it is. Parchment. Aged parchment smudged and discolored on which is written the annotated instructions for the incantation of lesser palingene pal palingenesis? Powerful resurrection ritual. That? It looks like a butchered version of the ritual of lesser palingenesis. The palingenesis. ritual of... That ritual. The one that brings someone back. That ritual. Yes. That ritual. Okay, so... We just do this, right? God, I hope I'm right. Otherwise, I probably softlock myself. Shit. Okay. Reveal an echo. I don't know why I'm always confusing what I need to do with these. Through a single point passes an infinity of paths. As flesh unto verb. As verb unto heart, as heart unto flesh. Death's knot is unsevered, and I shall cut it. Something's happening.
Let me kiss the heart. Caleb Watson invoked a ghost without a body for it to inhabit, so it took his. Caleb is no longer Caleb. Hmm. Is he still in there too? He used pieces of his wife and also of his brother. Ruth, Alexander, Caleb could be any combination of them in there. Let's go find out which. Hmm. Okay. Now let me see. So I fought in this tiny area. I don't think I've been here. Oh no, no, I have. I yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I explored all that. Hmm. Then where? Point of interest there. Maybe that's the. That might be the box that I'm looking for. Oh, sorry, Grave. Oh, sorry, Grave. I'm just here for the boss. Okay, let's see. So I entered behind me, went straight through. So I'm gonna go around this way real quick. See if I can find more dolls. Oh, there's something here. Can hear a white bird thing as well. Oh. oh, that's one of those. No, no, no. Get her. Get that one. Nah. I was just doing the outburst thing. Ah! This is too tight. Too tight. Too tight. I'm stuck. I have no room here. Oh, I don't have any spirit power. Okay, in that case, I'm gonna just back up. Snap out of it! Shit. Shit. Oh god. Can you get up here? Nope. Then just do it the old fashioned way. Say that's your face. Jesus. Ugh, this tiny space. I do need your help, but teach them not to mess with a banisher. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Yes. Just need a little bit of space. Ah That made me sweaty. It's too tight in here, I couldn't run around. What was that? Oh. A little box. Now where am I hearing? Where am I hearing those little balls? Maybe. What's this little house, huh? I'm sure it has something. Mm-hmm. What have we got here? Oh, yes! Found one. That was number two. <laughs> nice, 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 nice. Getting loads of stuff. Getting close to the box. I'm sure the last farmer idol is somewhere here. I feel a draft from the invisible. There it is. Where? Oh, where? Ah. Box. Mm, this is cost, no doubt. But I need. To, I think I'm short one. 
Yeah, two of three. Oh, there it is. Found it. Let's do it. Unbounding. Jump. Slash. Circle. Dolls. Wapoo. Strong you were, weak you now go. What is it? A protective charm. For Antea. Damage dealt by Antea is increased by 60% against full health enemies. That doesn't really do much. <laughs> she has this one equipped now. Yeah, that's that makes, makes more sense. To me. Like, they're only full health the first hit. And then you'd be back to normal. Whereas the other one that I have equipped now is like, the first hit is weak, but after that you're stronger. That makes more sense to me. But if you've played it and you found a great combination, then let me know. I do kind of like my rifle build at the moment. Okay. So I've ex explored the cemetery. There's stuff here, but I'm sure some of the hauntings will take me there like the current one did. So I think for now I'm going to go back to town. Until other story stuff takes me further west. That ritual, I'm not... I suspect this beyond me. It's not, but we agreed you won't need it. Besides, Caleb's work was poor. Your work is good. A ritual like that. Good is not a word that comes to mind. Wait, how is he possessed if this is a no spirit zone? I guess it doesn't oh, work like that. All is well. Nothing bad will ever come to us again. So is it the brother and the wife in his body? Shite off. We've been to God's Acre. Quite a tale it told us. You're not Caleb, are you? Or at least not entirely. Ah. Can't fog you. Alexander Watson. Long tale short. Caleb tried to bring his dead wife back, and I live here now. So many questions. Where to even start? How did it happen? He was trying to bring his wife back. How did you end up in the mix? Caleb made a fine cobbler, a poor brother, a worse husband, and a truly terrible witch. The ritual went to shite, because... <laughs> Of course he did. <laughs> Do both of you share Caleb's body? Share? <laughs> no. This house of flesh is mine. But because I am a generous man, I allow my brother to live in the cellar. We were twins. I was the rotten half, they said. But who's the rotten half now? There's something else you should know. If you don't know it already, I'm not alone. I completed the ritual. My darling Ruth is in here too. Hmm. Caleb was no saint, but this is hellish grim. Does he deserve it? Aye, he does. And it's not like I killed him. He's alive in here somewhere. Watching me ruin his name. Hmm. He can hear me now. Destroying his reputation. As I had to hear him destroy mine when he painted me a fornicator. How oh, nice. He took our love, Ruth and mine, and killed it. Now our love's reborn, and he can do naught but sit and watch. Caleb was a cad. Shite on him. Let him suffer. Hmm. You died trying to save Ruth from a burning house. True. True. 
I'm sorry. There's an awful way to go, and so young too. You deserve better. We deserved better, and now we have it. And with it, Caleb gets to make amends. For he did nothing. He stood and watched us burn. <clears throat> Caleb's name was ruined then. We're just putting the boot in. Mm. You used the ritual to bring Ruth's spirit into Caleb's body. Why? Love moves a soul to strange endeavors. We deserve a better life. I set myself to claiming it. Strange that he didn't like kidnap a lady to possess for Ruth to possess then. Well, Maybe she didn't want that. More so your desire. But what of Ruth? Did you consider what she wanted? Caleb stole a life from me. But he also stole Ruth's voice. She shrank beneath him. Of course she wanted a second chance at life. I'd like to hear this from Ruth. May I please speak with her? No! Mm. We've carved ourselves out a little happiness at last. I'll not have you break it. Please, leave us alone. Give us this. We need mm. to speak to her, one way or another. If he won't tell us anything, perhaps the house Ruth died in will. Okay. I'll be leaving you alone for now. Alone? <laughs> Not really. Hush now. Three people in one Hush body. Now. That's wild. Ruth Nothing and Alexander are having an affair again. in her husband's body. Oh. That's wrong. I can't find an angle with that. Isn't it just plain wrong? Something feels wrong. Something about Ruth. Mm, I feel like if she's more captive in there. We can talk to her. Okay. So, where's her house? Where did the house burn down? Oh, somewhere in here. Okay, we'll have to find it. That house there is missing a roof, so that could be it. Oh, one of these, maybe. Oh, <laughs> he's working in it. Oh, I've been here. Okay. Anything here? A nice chest. Don't mind if I do. And a wee little basket. Oh, look at that. So nice. They can grow vegetables. It doesn't look great, but that, those are some good tomatoes, if you ask me. Maybe not as many as it would like, but... Is this how I came up? Take care. The place is warded. Okay. The ghost wards feel far away from here. Just one keeps me from manifesting. Fancy knocking it down? Hmm, let me find it. Nothing here. Uh -huh. The ward's power is gone. <laughs> Hi. Now let's have There's a look. A way through. I can take care of it. Because <laughs> I turned the camera. So what do we have here, huh? The house that burned down. The roof fell in with them inside. There's a lot of debris. Mm-hmm. Couple of things I can do. Is there space for me to go through here? Oh! Okay. Well, 
Let's see here. Oh, we can go through here too. That is far enough. Hee <laughs> hee. Caleb and I had another discussion this morning. I went walking and caught him sobbing in the garden when I came back. He apologized, and I took that badly, too. He's kind and romantic and listens well, which is why I married him, but I'm sometimes uncomfortable. He is my husband and I am his wife, as a woman to be loved and not an icon to be worshipped. He loved her too strongly. <sighs> I must be near by. A beautiful homemade illustrated compendium of the birds of New Eden, complete with feathers found to match the drawings. Complete? Not quite. Two pages are missing feathers, bone breaker, crow, and herring gull. This work shows real sensitivity. Caleb? Maybe. Not Alexander. I suspect we've just learnt a little about Ruth. Okay. It's not really the tie we're looking for, though. Where am I not looking? Oh, did I just see it? There's something big down below. Something's here. Hidden. There it is. A withered human heart. It belongs to Ruth. This tie is doused with the essence of its ghost. Okay. Of course. Ruth's heart binds them like a bushel of rotting corn. Gil, what do you have there? Stop a heart. right there, you rank rump. Whatever you found, it ain't yours. You buried Ruth's heart in the ashes of the house that killed her. I find that odd. You, a ghost, went digging in the ashes of a dead woman's house. You're ill-positioned to call me odd. Don't think I haven't felt your presence before. Stow your tongue while I speak with Ruth. Ruth, can you hear me? Can you speak? Pock off and die. I'm in charge here. No. Hush ye, Alexander. I'll speak. Mm-hmm. I'm Ruth. I hear you. I'm Antea Duarte. We're here to help. Oh, I'm glad. Please, end this nightmare. Help me. Go to hell in a bag of shite. We're fine. And you have not the right, you hear? You've not the right. Oh, but we do. We are banishers, baby. So what should I... Should I just force Ruth to appear? Her heart! Give it back! Hear my voice and show your face. No more does he silence me. We may speak. Wait, what? Help me. Ah. Please. Okay. Who taught Caleb Who taught the ritual? Caleb yeah. the resurrection ritual. To say it was taught would mean he'd learned it. He read it off a page. As a sorcerer, Caleb makes a fine cobbler. Thing about Caleb, he was a good listener. As he worked, clients would bend his ear. The Haskell boy, for one. As Caleb pinned the governor's shoes, young Lammy would talk magic. Mm -hmm. Nonsense, really. But Caleb was listening. It's always the quiet ones. 
Lammy Haskell gave Caleb the resurrection ritual. I should have known. Always watch out for the quiet ones. After Lammy mentioned the ritual, Caleb became obsessed with it. He begged. Lammy, in his misplaced generosity, gave it. Caleb was intent on dark work. Lammy furnished written instructions. Mm. Caleb's letter changed your life. How did it feel at the time? <sighs> it tore me in two. I loved Alexander. But I deserved to marry a man who would be true. Caleb seemed decent. I, I believed he loved me. I thought I'd married the better brother. But I'd married a liar. A liar and a devil. And yet, not even he deserves this. No one deserves this. When did you know it was a lie? When did you learn that Caleb had lied to you about his brother's infidelity? Who goes worse shod than the shoemaker's wife? There was no one moment. One day I knew what he'd done and knew I'd known it for the longest time. Hmm. Alexander had his flaws, but he loved the whole of me. Now I'm sewn into a festering sack with the quivering remnants of my husband and the angry ghost of his dead brother. Please, let me out. Hmm. Ruth, your husband Caleb's botched resurrection ritual brought you back but allowed his brother Alexander to take you hostage. Once we deal with the Watson brothers, you shall be free to ascend. Do what you must. I'll suffer it if it leaves me free to go. No! We can stay. Please, Ruth, let us stay. Look at you. Your counterfeit, a sham of a thing. Your so-called life is no life at all. Caleb lied and stole your love. But when the time was right, you lied and stole his body. We're ending this nonsense now. Hmm. Okay. So, blame Caleb. Banish Alexander or send Alexander. I would want to banish Alexander. Sure, he shouldn't have lied, or the brother shouldn't have lied about him being a cheat, but... The fact that he took over his brother's body and then put Ruth hostage in there with him, I think that's bad enough. Alexander, yours is no romantic fable. There is no moral to this tale. It's just You're holding a, a woman's tick. soul captive. Nothing more. Yeah. No, Caleb can go to hell, for he well deserves it. But Ruth and I are in love. Greedy men fight over a woman as if she were a thing. Mm -hmm. I'm done with that old story. Time to tell a better tale. Ruth is free to go. I shall have my rest now. Thank you. Life to the living, death to the dead. Hell yeah. I wonder if Caleb survives the ordeal. Are they gone? Yep. Am I speaking with the cobbler, Caleb Watson? That you, Caleb? I, I, I think... Uh, yes, that's me. Or it, it was me, once. For my bastard brother was my hollow keeper. You're not entirely innocent, though. If you'll permit the unfortunate expression, there was more than one of you in it. Mm -hmm. My brother deserved damnation, and you gave it to him. I am an imperfect man, but, uh, but if you're considering the same for me, I'll not go without a fight. I too am an imperfect man. I have mercy and patience in limited supply. <laughs> Let's not test those limits further, eh? Yeah, I think that's a good conclusion to the tale. Alexander loved Ruth like a man loves his hat. <laughs> love a woman Possession. like a thing, and you do not love her at all. Mm. Ruth deserved better. 
in life and in death. That was something. Don't take it to heart. Their choices are not your business. Our choices are my business. And the consequences And Bruce ascended, so that's nice. Don't waver. We could win a battle, but we can't win the war. I Nobody what's down should here. conquer death. And we don't want to pay the price of trying. Uh, oh, I can't get it. I hear you. Maybe Good. it's... Now, let's see what Lamy Haskell has to say about raising spirits from the dead. True. Is he in the back there? Report to the governor. Wait, there's a point of interest here? In this house? In this house. Oh. How did I miss this? Oh, I have a key now. Ah. Ooh, new outfit. Oh. It looks cool, but honestly... Oh, I only now notice the pants have the... have like a pat plate pattern. That is nice. I can't upgrade this one. Let's see. So this is my current one. Physical resistance 20, 11, 8, 16, 23, 11, 8, 16. So this one's way more vitality. Hitting an enemy grand Spanish points. Melee attack. Oh, I think I'll go with this one then. It's not as pretty, but if I can upgrade it too, that's pretty good. Ooh, dude, I love the scarf. Cool. Yeah, that is cool. The embroidery is really cool. Damn, dude. He looks like he's ready for war. I do like the vanish points. Anything that makes the vanish points go up quicker is good, I think. Let's see. Healing essence. Defeating an enemy. Manifestation. With a manifestation restores seven health points. Using outbursts. Oh, that's a manifestation, isn't it? While the banish gauge is full, increases outburst damage by 75%. Ooh, that would be a good one, though. If I have a full... Yeah, let's do that. If I have a full bar, instead of shooting one target with a lot of damage, I can choose to do a ton of damage to everyone around me. Let's upgrade! Let's take a look at that outfit of yours, huh? So it is at 5. Ah, soul shards. Nice. Do it. I need fur. 20 more. Okay, I think I bought all that lady's fur, didn't I? But that's good. Level 5 is very nice. Each enemy... Oh yeah, this is her punch going up. Mm, yes. Let's do it. We need void splinter and magnetite for this. And then this brooch can do outburst area size up. okay copper and nest silt i think that's it for the upgrades three or three charges nice how do you like my outfit Antea? Yeah, I wish the leather... It, it makes more sense to look like this, but I wish the the leather was like a color. Maybe like a faded blue or something. Ooh, pretty rug. I like it. Oh, I should have that. Ooh, upstairs. Hello? Anyone home? Nope, nothing here. <laughs> cozy bed. I'm sure it's it looks cozier than it actually is. I wonder what they used to fill the mattress back in the day. Anything here? Nope. Any 
anything here? Oh, there's the dude. I'm taking that. Banish your tax. Governor. May I help you, Mr. McCraith? Your son's a witch. <laughs> I have to admit, this is an unusual case. Yes, yes, but have you solved it? I believe so. But the culprit was not responsible for the plague. Do you like my new outfit? Not directly. Have you found the witch or have you not? Someone here has been dabbling in some dark magic. I have the name. So? What are you waiting for? Hmm. Don't you want to hear the name? I do not need to. The principle is what matters. Not exactly. The name is Lamentation Haskell. Mm -hmm. No, it can't be. My son is studious. Curious, too curious at times, perhaps. But he does not have a bad bone in his heart. He showed Caleb Watts in a ritual. A cobbler used it and became possessed. Even if true, it would only mean my son was exposed to corruption. It happened before. Bring me proof, Banisher. Find the real source of evil. I'll get it. Mark me. Hmm. I must find your son, Governor. Sooner rather than later. His interests take him hither and thither. If hither he and here, thither? He must be working on the outskirts. He's been sprucing up one of the abandoned houses there. I ordered them emptied when the sickness hit. Yeah. Take the gate key. Go there. See for yourself. You're wrong about him. You're wrong about my son. Hmm. Needless to say that I count, of course, on your discretion. So your son is a bit of a recluse? Off scripts of town? He was quick to condemn till it was his, his own, own son on the block. Yeah. Who's he really protecting? We'll bring him the proof he wants. If the boy is guilty, his father may not be able to protect him. Hmm. Okay. Let's go say hi, I guess. I haven't been in here. Oh, locked. There might be a way to open this door from the other side. No, really? Let's have a look then. Okay, I can get there. Oh, stuck. Go around this way. Oh, maybe I can exit through this house. Whose house is this? Huh? Who lives there? There's a dude just standing there. Do you mind if I steal this? It's just a Bible, isn't it? Oh, good luck in Boston. Don't forget, I believe in you as you believe in him. Wow. High praise. Banish your tax. My dear Perry, I'm writing this letter to you so you will take it with you to the new world and not forget the old woman I am. I'm so proud of you. You are no longer the little boy I picked off the streets. You are now a complete and passionate man. I am sure that the new world will bring you the meaning you seek and that you will be the most talented baker in your area. Be as passionate as you are now, remain dignified in the face of adversity, and pay tribute to this beautiful calling of ours. Don't forget that feeding others is an honorable mission and that our Lord is watching over you. Visit me one day if you can, but above all, write to me. I wish you best of luck. Aspen. An aspiring baker. A baker of the new world. Hee <laughs> hee, shirts. Oh, hello. She's your candles. Nice. There's more. Nice. Okay, so here's the house I wanted to get into. Aha. Uh -huh. Open. So who lived here? Who used to live here? Ooh. Nice. Not that big a reward, unless I'm missing something. I'm not 
really anything I can see. Oh, wait, yeah. Try to bring out Antea, but I can't. Oh, is it this key that I got? Aha! Uh -huh. We didn't need a key for that. Yeah, I totally forgot. this here. Hmm. Thank y'all. Oh, point of no return. Hmm. Hell's balls. What happened here? Something's emanating from under there. No wonder this place is off limits. Mm -hmm. And he wants his house right by it? I was hoping we could see something, but no. What is it? Oh, this. The jump. Hello, buddy. Watch out. We made it angry. They never learn, do they? <laughs> <laughs> Super shot. Meet the shot. That can't be stopped. I'm fine. I am strong man. Nice. Oh, one of these the must again. be Lammy's hideaway. Um, just see before I crawl through that. If there's anything here? Anything to go Lamy. through? You here? Stab him through the door. Locked. There might be a way to open this door from the other side. Ooh, this is a lot of stuff. A set of tools including a scalpel, knife, magnifying glass, and other objects. Book on herbalism. Okay. Not necessarily it's a it smells a little witchy, but not necessarily bad. Herbalism can be good. Okay, now how are we going to open the door? Oh, no need. How is this? Corvus Corax or Common Raven, omnivorous and opportunistic by place and season, carry on. What they eat? Oh, dead animals? This requires a key. My dearest Lammy, it has been, as always, a great satisfaction to talk with you again. I love your enthusiasm and wit. You remind me of when I was your age. So eager to know more about the greatest mysteries of our world. Of all worlds. I only wished I could have stayed longer, but I must go back to Providence. Until then, here are some quick notes I throw at you to quench your thirst. Some of the meager research my humble self has been able to gather with time and patience. I believe it is fair to admit we know nearly nothing concerning the dreadful Aralu, only the rarest writing dare to talk about. Is it the mythicized hell only the bolas dare to travel to and come back alive? Are all these almost forgotten tales fragments of an unveiled or lost truth? I truly cannot say. But I know this, my dear Lammy. You and me are like Orpheus, ready to cross the forbidden waters and bring back the only fiancé we really cherish. Knowledge. Ah, to map those uncharted lands, to pass the threshold and bravely walk those forbidden deserts and icy rivers only the maddest poets sang about. 
See what stand beyond and come back to dream of some more about it. What a thrill, my young friend. What a goal. If only I was younger, just like you, I would follow you in this untold journey. For now, I can only advise you to be careful. Yes, the threshold between our world and the other side is thinner in New Eden. That does not mean it will be easier to travel there. According to some of my research, some already tried in this area. Petty warlocks and p puny witches. Maybe it is why the threshold is so thin. Maybe it is why the dead seem to be so easily allowed to walk this land. Who can, who can say for sure? Last week, while I was investigating on my own, I have clearly noticed some very peculiar vibrations coming from an ancient mill located above a cliff by the seaside. Quite a creepy place, if you ask me. If you were to investigate further into the possibility to find a threshold to the mythical Aralu before we meet again, this could be the place to start. But be sure to be prepared, my dear boy. My old heart could not bear to lose another promising and beloved colleague. Until we meet again, I can but advise you to keep all this secret. As blessed and gentle as they are, too many of your local friends would not welcome the kind of knowledge you and me both share so cheerfully. Etienne Roulet. Ah, Roulet. Mean anything to you? Not a thing. Hmm. He mentioned an old mill. Seemed fascinated by the place. Is it on the map? This? So this is the... I knew something would take me further west. Okay. The incisions are clean. The precision of an expert. Hmm. There's magic here. Though faint. Hmm. Key to the chest. Nothing incriminating yet. Let me note. This place is even more fascinating than I imagined. So many unanswered questions waiting to be answered. Monsieur Roulette was right. Or Monsieur Roulet was right. I sh I'm sure that the tragic history of the old mill has much to do with it. I shall go there. I shall do my work there. Unmolested by suspicious and unscientific neighbors. There is much to do. Remember what we found at Caleb Watson's? Maybe we're not looking in the right place. The mill. If I had something to hide, I might hide it in an abandoned mill. Mm -hmm. Oh, we can see it. Oh my god, you can see the mill in the distance. Ivy blocks the path. That is cool. That's where we're going. I told you guys, something would take us further west. 